Well, we wrap up our Where Are They Now series this morning with a local singer whose talent took the nation by storm. She was the third place finalist on the third season of American Idol in 2004. This Marinol grad won brown bags to stardom back in 2001 and the Road to Fame Youth Competition in 2003. And joining us live this morning via Skype from Las Vegas is Mililani's own Jasmine Trias. Good morning, Jasmine. Good morning. Hey, good, great Aloha. to see you. Aloha. Good to Good to hear you guys and see you guys. <laughs> well, so the first question we want to ask is, what are you doing in Vegas? Well, um, right now I've uh, we've been I've been performing a lot with the Society of Seven, and um, actually I just finished my bachelor's degree at the University of Phoenix. So um, now that yay, <laughs> so now that I'm I'm done with that, um, I'm actually taking a bit of time off from performing and recording my second album and, you know, working on some projects that I've been wanting to work on for a while um, now that I'm done with school. But I also still uh, perform with the Society of Seven, and I'll, I will be performing with them at the, at the, and uh, later on in the year. Well, that sounds fabulous. And let's go back to 2004. I mean, it seems like it's yesterday, but that was a, a while back now, early on in your career. Talk about those American Idol days and, and what it was like being on that national stage. Wow. Um, let's see. It's been about like eight years now, I believe. And um, it's, you know, for, it's it's been an, an it was an amazing experience. And um I learned so much from it, and I just, I, it does feel like it was just yesterday. Um, you know, it just, it was a lot for me to take in at that time, and now looking back, I just appreciate everything that happened, um, because it gave me the opportunity to pursue my dreams and, and my passions of singing and performing and recording, so American Idol has has really completely changed my life, and um, I'm able to really just live my dream. And what are, what are your dreams? What is your plans for the future? Well, my plans for the future are to um, continue performing and continue to pursue music and um, record, uh, um, which is what I'm doing right now. And, you know, um, I also want to work on um, a Hawaii album. That's something that I've always wanted to do, like a Hawaii tribute album, just to say thank you to all of Hawaii for all of their support. And um, I also um, am working on, on a Christmas album. And my second album as well and I'm working on a show here in Las Vegas um, so lots of projects in the works right now yeah well last question before we go what do you miss most about Hawaii being away well I definitely miss my family and I you know Hawaii is always going to be my home and I, I miss it so much you know I've traveled so many places in the world and you know there there seems to be no place like Hawaii Hawaii just is just such a beautiful place and you know um, I miss the food, I miss the people, I miss the culture, I miss my family, um, I miss my fans, um, everything. Um, but Hawaii is always in my thoughts and, you know, I, I, I hope to, to, to perform in Hawaii again soon. Well, Jasmine Trias, it is great to see you. You look gorgeous, yeah, by the great. way, Thank live you. from Las Vegas. So come back and visit, okay? I definitely will. Thank you so much. Thanks, Jasmine. And to see this interview again or any of the interviews from our Where Are They Now series, just head to the top video section of our website, KITV.com. It's now 6.51. We'll be right back.